The Lanny 2000 fountain pen will always have a special place in my pens. That's the original box that I got my first Lanny 2000 in and the box has changed. And this is the box that I've got my most recent fountain pen which is a double broad. And I'm trying out this new pen in the double broad with the Robert Oster Muddy Crown ink. Now Muddy Crown by the Australian ink manufacturer Robert Oster is a slightly muted violet so it should be easy to handle. It shouldn't shriek. It should be a nice violet that should look very natural in shadows if you're painting or sketching nature. It's one of almost 50 coloured inks that I've received for my 74th birthday which is today. And I'm going to be learning about these inks and the new pens that I've got. So I'm going to pass on what I discover to you. Now there are multiple reasons why I love the Lamy 2000 pen. It's a piston fill and it holds a lot of ink in the belly of the pen. And that allows me to sketch for quite a long time. Maybe do many sketches before I have to stop and refill the pen. So that suits me. The ink flows very wet out of the pen, so I can work in a very painterly manner. I'm not feeling the pen is scratchy, or I'm not. I'm feeling I'm more painting than drawing. So I just love that. I can paint in a very loose, impressionistic way, even though I'm sketching with a pen. And by adding water with a brush, or putting the ink into water or dampness on the paper, I'm discovering how much the ink will react or not to water. So every ink I use will respond differently. Now my very first painting medium was inks and I loved them. When I was seven years old I set up my first art studio in a converted chook shed. I did the conversion and I had um, charcoal I'd made myself in little fires. <laughs> And I was a very proud owner of my very first bottle of Indian ink and a mapping pen. Now, there's another young girl who would know more about inks than I do. Now, I'm 74 and I've only just received my first coloured inks, so I'm learning on the job. But little pen girl of eight has a YouTube channel and she's extremely good at demonstrating coloured inks and fountain pens of various types. And I highly recommend her channel. Check in the description below and there is a direct link through to her channel. Give us some support. I love to encourage originality and creativity. Well, I probably understand enough about Robert Oster's Muddy Crown ink now that I'll be able to pick it up and use it to create artwork with, knowing how it will respond. And as you saw, the Lamy 2000 pen worked beautifully straight out of the box.